I think like when you have the top 15 girls in any World Cup, they all have the ability to win, and so you're trying to find the missing link. And I think the the thing that's between your shoulders is kind of what limits you or enhances you. And I think that it's kind of the hidden the hidden secret. And yeah, I think it's a really good thing to work on. It has so much power. It's crazy and it's scary. Is this somebody who you've known for a while? Is there somebody you just you looked up in the yellow pages? Yeah. Hey. <laughs> um, let's see. Uh, no, actually, she used to ski us on the national team, Canadian national team, and then she works in. Uh, she worked at the University of Denver, and I met her through a friend who went to the University of Denver, who was a ski racer also. So that was about 10 years ago. So she understands skiing. She's detached enough from the ski world that it, there's no conflict. Um, she's a super energetic person. And she works on not only sports psychology, but just making you a better person and understanding yourself better, because I think it also goes hand in hand. Cool. Um, just finally, is there any... any um result that you've had, a success that you've had, you can do directly relate, draw the line from A to B and say, you know what, uh, something was said, you know, conversation we had that really helped me on that particular day. You know what, there's been moments, I think I had a race in Sestriere in which I was really struggling with training runs and just gave me some fuel to my fire and just kind of went from that. Um, but there's been a couple of races along the way that, that for sure have, have been impacted, the results have been impacted from a sports psychologist.